Welcome to Murray Mysteries. just go one day, one day without some kind of horrifying revelation. I just found out I'm stuck inside a castle in the middle of nowhere with a man who will probably kill and eat me, Hannibal style. Oh, I know what I'll do. Look out the window for a bit. Look at the moon, calm myself down. Maybe even look around for an escape route. But no, I can't have one moment of rest, can I? I have to look down and see my future murderer crawl down the frickin' wall like a lizard. I, I can never unsee that. If I get out of this alive, I'm going to be sending this man my therapy bill. That'll show him. <sighs> right. Get it together, Jonathan. Look on the bright side. The murder lizard has left the castle, which means you can safely look for a way out. Well, safely might be an overstatement. Now, I had a look at the front door last night when I left to go to bed. It, it was locked, of course. It, of course it was. Probably keeps the key in his room, which is less than ideal. Still, I, I should try and find it on the off chance he's left his door unlocked. I'm not sure I want to see what's in this room, if I'm honest. Could be discarded skins or eggs or creepy lizard children with sharp teeth and... Ugh. I've got to stop speculating. Whatever it is, it can't be worse than what he has planned for me if I stay. God, I wish I'd pay more attention. I have no idea where he goes after we've had our talks. I'm always the one who heads to bed first. This is what I get for having a consistent sleep schedule. I don't think I've been up these stairs before. It's worth a shot. Go! It's no wonder he's so fit between the lizard parkour and the stairs of death. He's got our thighs of steel. Oh, thank God the landing. I'm just gonna sit for a minute, catch my breath. I should have downloaded that running app Lucy likes. Maybe I'd have more stamina. In my defense, I didn't think I'd need it to escape a creepy castle. Or... <coughs> we meet again. You're not going to tell me, are you? Oh, of course you wouldn't. We're friends, you and I. When I get out, I'm going to send someone to fetch you. I'm the oldest. I get to go first. That's not fair. You always go first. Calm down. We'll all get a turn. Oh, um, hello. Um, who... Who are you? See? Plenty of life in him. You go first. Oh, I, I, I'm very flattered you would want to. Uh, th thing is, I, I'm afraid I'm the wrong person for... It, it's not you, no. Uh, you're all um charming. It's just that I, I, I'm asexual, you see. I, I'm monogamous. Uh, I have a girlfriend. Her, her name is uh, Mina. She's... talks too much. Make him stop. Look, I'm sure you all know the importance of consent, so why don't we all just take a step back and make a cup of tea and... Get away from him now. But we're so hungry. I told you explicitly that this one was off limits. You'll get your turn when I'm done with him. I have something else for you tonight. Fine. He looks weak anyway. Look at him. Did he faint? Good luck with that. He won't last a day. You better hope he does, or you won't get any leftovers. Now scat! <laughs> so rude. What did we ever see in him? Is this... Yes, it's still recording. Some battery power. Wait a minute, that's good. It means he didn't find the phone. It's, it's evidence. I need to copy all this audio onto my spare memory card in case something happens to it. I need a lot of proof to get anyone to believe me if I get out of this. When I get out of this. 
I have to. For Mina. For myself. For whoever this man goes after next. <sighs> every time I've seen him, every time something's happened to me, it has been at night. He, he probably sleeps during the day. I can't be sure of that. Even if I could find his room and unlock it, if, if I find him awake, it's, it's over for me. <sighs> but then again, if I don't get that key, it'll be over for me anyway. I know where his window is. I've seen him crawl out of it. And... Oh, God, there's only one way, isn't there? Going to have to get in from the outside. Murray Mysteries is a Nove storytelling production. This episode was written and produced by May Tudyk and featured Tom McGuinness as Jonathan Harker, Jonathan Tilly as Drac, Gilbert Koshek Tudyk as The Beast, Mel Nichols as Vampire Lady 1, Megan John as Vampire Lady 2, Christina Crawick as Vampire Lady 3, original music by Sophie Pay. If you like our work and would like to support us, you can sign up for our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash storytelling, or follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr. Thank you for listening.